Many clients at Central CCAC were identified at risk for adverse events, and Central CCAC found that over 70% of clients discharged from hospital did not adhere to their discharge orders related to their prescriptions. It would have helped when I was in the hospital um, about three years ago because there were so many medications, and I'm taking 33 a day, that it was difficult for the staff at the hospital really to keep me on track and on time. And um, I have my routine, and, and the routine is important because it keeps it working right. How it works with the pharmacist consultation is the pharmacist would contact the client and set up an appropriate appointment time. They would meet at the client's house the client's home environment is the best place to do this consultation as it allows us to see how the client is actually managing with their vials and their dose sets or their uh, compliance packages, depending on what method of administration they are using. The Medication Management Support Services Program is targeted to have 1,600 clients serviced by a pharmacy consultation in this calendar year. Referrals come to the pharmacy service through case manager assessment. Hospital case managers, community case managers, or office case managers would identify clients that would meet certain criteria that would make them eligible to receive this service. The criteria includes the client must be on three or more prescription medications, they must have one or more chronic disease states, and they should have an additional risk factor that has been identified that may be due to their medications, such as falling, repeated ER visits, or pain levels that need some better control. The Central CCAC worked very closely um, since 2008 and implemented this program that has enabled um, thousands of clients to have a medication review and have their medications um, improved so that there's a simple, uh, safe, effective way of managing medications. When we did the list, I had mine a little bit, bit different because it separated out with different headings, but it still covered the, all the medications that she had to review with me any intolerances or allergies I had. And the piece that was really critical for me was the schedule, the medication schedule. I found that that was the piece that was missing. What would happen if I wasn't as alert or able to uh, keep in track of my meds and taking them properly? So the schedule is what kept it together. The clients who have uh, been on our program have actually benefited and we identified concerns initially when we uh, started this program because we recognized there were a number of clients who had pain issues, had significant number of pain falls and ER visits and hospitalizations. We knew that there was a need to develop a standardized program so that it would improve the safety and the quality of client care. And by having this program in place, clients have been able to demonstrate uh, through a number of ways uh, the importance and the benefits they've received through this program. Um, I really had to really think differently about medication because 20 years ago I never had anything. And over that time, I've developed some complex medical conditions that have required that I understand my medication, how to take it, when to take it, and if there are side effects. Some data uh, with, that we collected also demonstrated cost savings to the system and that we identified a reduction in medications and looking at those medications, had the client been taking those over a year, um, we would have identified some cost savings and that we uh, demonstrated that about $100 uh, was saved per client um, when not taking that medication any longer. You know, because I know what it's like for me, that all of us become more aware of our health, our health issues, the medications we need and that we take it and how we take it. Because we're going to be more of us trending down the road and this is not good news. If we don't get a grip on this, nothing's going to work right. So I really see the system um, benefit from this tremendously. And I'm, I'm going to benefit too. I'm pleased about that.